Hello everyone, Abdul Muqsith here with another episode of Croco Tips. Today we're going to discuss how you can store form data or form submission in third-party applications such as Google Sheet or Microsoft Excel. So let's start. All right. So in order to make integration between these application, we need third-party tools such as Zapier and Integromat. Uh, Zapier I think the webhook in Zapier are paid. That's why I will focus on Integromat. Now Integromat in past was Integromat company. Now it is part of Mac.com. So what you need to do is to create your account in Mac.com. I will sign into my account. the first step here is to create a scenario a scenario is a task uh, and automation a flow click on the plus icon so it will show you all the applications here we need to choose webhook webhooks okay and we need to choose trigger when mail hook receive we need webhook receive the data okay Let's add a webhook and name it, for example, data from checkpoint and save. Okay, so we got this webhook URL. Copy the URL. Now go back to your dashboard. We'll create a new form with Jet Form Builder. Let's remove first field I need to take full name let's duplicate email address email and phone number all right now click on jet form and click on post submit action and we will change it to webhook follow webhook click on the pencil icon and paste your webhook update and we will publish it let me add a name now remember i just created a simple form you can apply it on anything for example you have a form front end form for the user where they can add a new post a new cpt or a new cct or they want to send an email or whatever part of the form you can add additional webhook to push your data to excel for record purposes let's go back to dashboard and i will create a new page my form and let's call jet form here and call to hook publish and publish let me check the page so we have the form i will enter my name and my email and mobile number click on submit and the form data has been successfully submitted now right click on run this module only so it will start recording the data and I will push one time more from here submit and we receive a green check means we receive the data if you click here you will see the form data okay so we have these three fields form ID and the referral URL also now the next step is click on this plus icon we already received the data what do you want to do with this data so i will add google sheet i want to save this data to google sheet you can use microsoft excel and any other platform also add a row then it will ask for the account i already connected my gmail it will ask for the sheet my sheet name is jet form builder record i have three fields so 
we will choose from here get form builder record it will ask for the sheet name we only have one sheet and it has headers also now we have three columns name so click on this text box name should be name email should be email and phone number should indicate phone number and click ok all right so our integration has been successfully done click on save let's go back to our scenarios and make sure it's turned on okay we don't have any data let's try it again submit and we got our data in the excel format now it's up to you how you want to utilize this data but this is how webhook works in JetForm builder submit and we got the record here okay so if you have any question please write in the comments thank you so much